Recent appearances by Carol Middleton, Zara Tindall and Peter Phillips' girlfriend at Wimbledon have sparked speculation about family dynamics within the British royal circle, sending a subtle message to Meghan Markle about familial solidarity. The absence of senior working royals from this year's Wimbledon has been notable, despite the royal family's long-standing association with the prestigious event. Since 2016, Princess Catherine has served as the patron of the All England Lawn Tennis and Croquet Club, yet no senior royals have attended thus far. However, Carol, Zara and Peter's girlfriend have seemingly paid a tribute to Princess Catherine with their presence at a favourite event and wearing her favourite fashion house. On a recent outing to Centre Court, Carol Middleton, Zara Tindall and Peter Phillips' girlfriend made a joint fashion statement by wearing dresses from the same designer, coincidentally featuring a similar floral print. Carol Middleton opted for a stylish white floral and green dress from Me Plus M, which quickly sold out following her appearance. She complimented her outfit with a grey checkered blazer from the same brand and sunglasses from Zanzan, a brand owned by her daughter, Pippa Middleton. Her choice of footwear, £495 tan block heels from Emmy London, completed her ensemble. Zara Tindall showcased a Me Plus M berry print maxi dress, also sold out post-appearance, paired with a green leather clutch from Anya Hindmarch, and £740 white leather espadrilles from Saint Laurent. She accessorised with £49.99 nude sunglasses from Soak. Meanwhile, Peter Phillips attended with his new girlfriend Harriet Sperling, an NHS nurse. Sperling turned heads in a silk water lily print maxi dress from Me Plus M, priced at £375, paired with block heels from Russell and Bromley, costing £245. Despite these familial displays, uncertainty looms over whether Princess Catherine will present the single trophies at Wimbledon this weekend. Kensington Palace and Wimbledon organisers have yet to confirm her attendance, especially amid reports of a cancer diagnosis. In parallel developments, Royal News highlights ongoing tensions between Prince Harry and the British Royal Family. Since stepping back from their senior royal roles in 2020, Harry and Meghan Markle have frequently criticised the monarchy, fueling public debate. Harry, set to receive the Pat Tillman Award for service at the 2024 ESPU Wise, has faced challenges integrating back into royal circles during visits to the UK, often staying in public accommodation due to strained familial relations. Recent events, such as their absence from Trooping the Colour and Meghan Markle's reported venture into jam and dog treat production on the same day, underscore the rift. Sources close to Harry suggest that he feels excluded and has expressed concern for Princess Catherine's health following media reports of a cancer diagnosis. Observers speculate on Harry's emotional state, noting his perceived outsider status and longing for familial connections, particularly with the Princess of Wales. In response to these developments, insiders reveal Harry's alleged distress over his perceived exclusion, contrasting sharply with Meghan Markle's attempts to reach out to Catherine. Despite these efforts, scepticism remains high regarding the reintegration into royal life, with accusations often overshadowing words in the public eye. The source cried to Closer magazine that the clown prince and spectacular buffoon is heartbroken and confused by the way they've cut him off and seemingly haven't given it another thought. Maybe some ayahuasca would help him gain the insight that he needs. Harry, enough of the complaints, no one's convinced. Your wife undermined Catherine with a jam and dog treats on the day of trooping the collar, showing that actions speak louder than words.